everyone, it's Tracy. Welcome back to my channel. Now today I am working on a cut file. I got this from Paige Evans. Her Facebook group is called Happy Scrappy Place. And this cut file is called Dice Circles and it's free. She gives a free cut file every week and they are all wonderful. I try to at least cut them out. Eventually I will be using them. Um, I say it is easier. It definitely gives a very uh, distinct look when you do use a die cut or, you know, a cut file. Uh, so this one, what I decided to do is take the different colors, papers that I had, and I just cut them in like those uh, skinny pie shapes and put them all around. I glued them down and you will see the hot mess that's on the back side, but that's okay. See, there it is completed. I really, really, really love the way that this is looking. Um, when I turn it over, I have to use some washi tape to adhere all the you know, the pie shapes down. And then I still don't really like, I'm afraid that it's going to get hung up or they're going to come off something. So I end up gluing another 12 by 12 uh, cardstock on the back so that, you know, it's nice and sturdy and I know that everything will be attached. It was, it was a pretty simple thing. Now this layout really doesn't have a title. Um, I had taken a photo of my daughter last year when we went to the Dallas Arboretum. This beautiful pumpkin display, um, we just had to take pictures of it, of course. It's just beautiful. And I had uh, started off pulling out the Cheeky Studio, those beautiful die cuts. I really wanted them to work. I tried and tried and tried. I could not make it happen. It just wasn't meant to be. I think the background was just way too busy. And the pieces that I had for, you know, from Cheeky Studios were just too little to stand out enough. So I think I need a plainer background to be able to use those um, die cuts. But they're just so cute. I am trying so hard to use them. Yes, Tuesday, I will be using them soon. I am determined. So instead, I pulled out the freckle fawn. This is the chipboard. And I pull out, um, it's a big 10, and underneath it, it says October. And the other piece, it's like a speech bubble. It has a, like a teal or a green around the edge, and it would be for journaling. I find it difficult uh, to journal on chipboard. It's kind of that slick surface. I don't really like that uh, to write on that. So I ended up putting a sticker there. So here are the these beautiful gold emboss uh, cork autumn leaves. I love those and I'm almost out of them. It makes me kind of sad. I'm going to have to get some more. I choose not to use any of the labels this time. And I love those plaid hearts again. Or they're the fall hearts. They're also from Freckle Fawn. So I put a couple of those down. And yeah, I knew that I was going to pull these stickers out. Now, I think that these stickers are designed for planners, but I do find one and it seems to go pretty well. It says making it happen. Now, even above that um, chipboard speech bubble is an arrow. It's really hard to see. Uh, it has like a brown tail. Uh, it says remember on it. So I have lots of textures and here are the sequins. These sequins are beautiful. They are from Spiegel Mom Scraps. There are all different sizes, all different colors and just perfect for fall. I use my Distress Collage Medium to adhere those down. They will not come off. So if you're looking for a good adhesive, I highly recommend it. It is uh, from Tim Holtz. I think I got mine. I don't know if I got it at Michael's or if I got it off of Amazon. 
This is a very quick video. I just glue everything down and I know that there's going to be some still shots at the end. I want to make sure that I mention all the ladies that are part of the Mindy Camp Monday. We are up to six ladies. We have Becky, Kathy, Daisy, Dolly, Jojo, and myself. Make sure you check out their pages. They are a great creative group of ladies. And if anyone else would be interested in joining us on the Mini Kit Monday, it's pretty laid back. Um, you just do what you can. And, you know, if you just can't do it one week, that's okay. So here's the still shots. And I will catch you guys next time. Thanks for joining me. Okay, bye-bye. <laughs>